Governor Phil Murphy makes moves to curb gun violence, announcing a package of new safety bills. CBS News' Meg Baker live in Metuchen with the very latest. Meg. Chris and Mary, we just heard from the governor. Now, New Jersey already has some of the strictest gun safety laws on the books. This is an expansion on that. The governor is calling on lawmakers to pass this set of bills in the next six weeks with the support of moms demand action. There's also so much we can do right here at home to save lives. New Jersey has some of the lowest rates of gun violence and gun deaths in the country. And these are not independent coincidences. Gun safety laws save lives. The first of what Governor Murphy calls common sense gun safety bills would require firearm safety training before purchasing a gun. You can't get a darn driver's license without proving you know how to drive a car. Why do we ask less when it comes to a gun? The next mandates safe storage of firearms in a lockbox or gun safe. Governor Murphy wants to close loopholes for importing out of state firearms and require an ID card within 30 days of residing here. And would establish an electronic ammunition sales record keeping system and would require micro stamping technology. That leaves a one of a kind imprint on every round of ammunition fired, a veritable license plate that can trace a specific round back to a specific gun. Sixth, let's once and for all ban the sale of 50 caliber firearms. Let's, uh, let's stop the charade that these weapons have any place in our communities. I spoke to some Metuchen High School students who were here for the event, and they said the current laws that are already on the books and the possibility of these new laws make them feel safer walking into school each day. In Metuchen, New Jersey, Meg Baker, CBS 2 News. Meg, thank you. Just